the rubbing on the brisket. So I did paprika, onion powder, garlic powder, mustard powder, ground cumin, um, both baking soda and salt and pepper. This is that. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Maddie, and if you're new here, my channel is all about motherhood and lifestyle. Today's video is all about a new recipe that I tried out. It's called barbecue brisket in the slow cooker. I'm pretty excited about it. So if you like what you see, hit that subscribe button down below. Hit that bell notification to get updates on when I post my next videos. And just like the channel, it really helps us out a lot. And then follow me on Instagram, the link's down in the bio. What should I rub it in? Like, what should I use to rub? Well, you're gonna use this. You're gonna go get a glove over there. You're gonna use your hand. Yeah. Like oh, this ain't this ain't um, chef Poros or well, that's what I want. When I need help. Okay. okay. <laughs> For wrist gets. I'm gonna have to cut that in there. It's not gonna fit in there. She said smush it in there. Give me a Denny. It doesn't matter how you do it as long as it's that's a lot of fat. I'll leave the fat on it. Why are you putting it like Because that? it's gonna be bloody. Oh, um, so just remove it once. Stick it over. And lay it down. I'm gonna grab another one that I've padded a little bit to get some blood on. Go sit, please. Um, mix it with 
the barbecue sauce. Flavor's gonna sink in. a large bowl. that but it says minced and it only wants two and like this is minced with water yeah no it does it just says minced it doesn't say like with water or anything and oh, it says I guess it's your preference and it says two it just says two so I guess I'm doing two little crumbs on it No, I think it's two tablespoons or two teaspoons. I'm not going to overdo it. It says two. You're not going to put two little pieces in there. But two what? Just do one. Just do one, just in case. Garlic's good for you. But you don't want to overpower it with garlic. Nobody said that. Then... Vinegar. It's not open. Cider vinegar, I should say. I know, I told you he was. Yeah. Look at him. Oh, he's looking outside. He likes to be outside. Yeah, one and a half. Now 
Not yet. I'm still making dinner. Dump that. You're gonna scoop it out. Get a spoon. Teaspoon of the Cheyenne. <clears throat> and then you need two teaspoons of this mustard crap. Of each onion powder. So one of the Cheyenne, it says. Yeah, one teaspoon. Onion powder, mustard powder. Um. You should really wipe them off before you stick them in the next one. Mm -hmm. Um. 
in the slow cooker. No, you mix it, but it wanted it all in the slow in the slow cooker, and not this. That's fine. You can just scoop it in there. <clears throat> I guess you wouldn't like put the stuff on top of it like that. It just cooks like that. Oh, because then when I take it out, I pour the rest of it on top of it. So it says um, slow to, cook and slow cooker for eight hours to ten hours.
here is the end result of the barbecue brisket it honestly was so good and it looks delicious if you like what you see subscribe below bye guys